Hello, my name is Lisa Urena. I live in Concord, New Hampshire, United States of America. I'm here in Concord. This is St. John Catholic Church here in Concord, New Hampshire. And it's very sad that right across the street from the Catholic Church is in a homeless camp when people suffering, the homeless people. I believe Pope Francis is telling the church to get involved in the homeless and poor people's life. And that's very true because I went to the church to try to talk to the preach a few times and let them know my work in the street with the poor and I always be ignored by Father Richard. He didn't care. He bullied me on one occasion when I tried to get him involved in our homeless poor situation here in Concord, New Hampshire. And it's very sad. But I don't hold nothing in my heart against Father Richard, even though he bullied me and he caused me to go to Concord Hospital with the anxiety because how he treated me very bad, called me name and all that. But I ask the bicho on New Hampshire, Peter Levacy, please get involved in our homeless community life. Our homeless people are suffering in the street. Please. Bishop Peter Levacy, help me with this project. There it happened Jesus Rehabilitation Center where our homeless people can have a place to live all year round. It's very sad how those big buildings are empty, church building. And we don't have much for our homeless community. I want to share with you What's going on across the street from the St. Peter Church here in Concord, New Hampshire? If you walk around and coming in this way, here is the homeless camp where I go now. And we see the reality that what's going on right in front of our eyes and sometimes we don't see it. Sometimes because we play blind. I'm sorry if the video is moving, but I'm working in the snow because I really want to share with you what's going on in our city of Concord. Here I'm going to the homeless camp right across the street from the big church. That's what Pope Francis is telling people, go in the street and get involved because he knows what's going on around the world when the church, not only Catholic church, but other church are ignored. The situation of the homeless people around. Here is the homeless camp. across the street from the church. It's very sad how these people live. They are not here, everybody gone. They got a shelter. This is what happened when the snow fell down, the homeless can get destroyed by the snow, heavy snow pulling down. The people that used to be here, the person, the handicapped with no leg, he been at the hospital for three weeks, maybe more, almost four weeks. When I came here, January 7, I need to call 911 for help because me, my friend was very sick. But I pray the Lord, the Catholic Church, all Christian Church, really get involved in this situation. It's not possible that across the street or churches 
things like that happen in the church never come down here and visit these people even those they know because they know what's going on with the homeless people around Pope Francis please keep doing the good job while you telling the people they get involved in the poor life because it's very important the church understand that Jesus say they need to care about the poor and about the needed. The book of Isaiah 58 verse 6 and 7 is very clear about what's going on with the homeless people. Yes, I'm writing a book about the homeless people. This is somebody choose. I pray God to provide a place for our homeless. The Dreaming Shelter, the Are Helping Jesus, the Habilitation Center. Amen.